Yeah. Right then, here we go. Yeah, MD, PB, probably about the 1936. Cream cracker, we call them. Cream cracker, cracker colours, which I gather was the racing colours of the MG's team at that time, apparently. Um, I'm not an expert on it, but that is apparently what they were. Um, I know MG TD is pretty well inside out, but I'm not too sure about the early ones, but here it is. And a bit I like about it, I used to in the old days, drive by the rev counter. Forget the myelometer. There was yeah, none of them worry about that. Then. No. There ain't none of them there waiting to cock you up and nick your money off you and all the rest of it, robbing buggers. Um, drive by the rev counter so you change gear by the rev counter and there it is green red as you can see they must have thought well we better chuck a speedo in better put one in just in case so we put a little speedo in down there who cares don't worry about it. look at the speedo um the only thing you had to worry about in them days was coppers jumping out on on your or, or stopping you and that and and it was only their word against yours saying that you know you, you were doing 40 mile an hour in the 30. it was a bit of a job to make it stick but um, so rev counter driving uh, but lovely, yeah, nice thing. Um, oh, it wants some work. It wants some work here, look. Now, again, it's the hinge that's moving there. I can see it in the bottom hinge. So what do you do? We said earlier, bolt it, don't screw it. So get that job sorted. Some bit of a problem with the running boards. Now, not worth repairing running boards, buy it. Simple as that. Running boards are tatty. They're solid, they're sound, look. But don't bother repairing them. There's hardly any point buying them. Job done. Um, it, the rest of the vehicle itself is very presentable. It's not a concourse winning vehicle, but it's a very presentable vehicle. And there's an argument for saying, don't do too much to it because you'll be scared to use it again. It's in the condition where it's very presentable, very attractive, will cause a lot of interest, lots of admiration. Just do this bit because it's a little bit unsightly. But other than that, I wouldn't worry too much. Right size wheels, as we know, and all the rest of it. Nice phonic strap across there, which makes it look sporty. Um, so I think lovely. I think it's a old oh, twin horns as well. Uh, and I think in, in most cases you probably see a spotlight on one side, but anyway, there you are. A little bit of an issue there, come on addressing sooner or later. Um, but what do you do? You know, you, like we, we keep saying, you spend all this money on them, and then you make them so mint, you look at the weather, oh, don't, don't go out today. That, just go out and use it. Park it anywhere. Park it in Sainsbury's car park. You know, I've spent all my life. And I, to this day, I still can't help it. I go into a car park and I've got to look for somewhere in the corner so that some chump don't come along and start opening his door on your car. You know, so all nice and clear, nobody in the car park, only down here, me up there in the corner, nicely out of my way, minding my own business. When you come back, some prick has gone and pulled right <laughs> alongside you, hasn't he? But anyway, what do you do about that? So use the thing, um, it's got, it's got uh, fly screens on it here, look. Yeah. On here, so drop the screen down, that'll look nice when that's good. Undo that, that side, that will drop that down this side. That'll look like a million dollars when that's dropped down there. There you go. Oh, look at that. Look at there that. Isn't that go. lovely look? Now we're talking, aren't we? Hey, now we're looking like a sports car. Beautiful. Look at that. I love it. I love the colour scheme, this cream cracker. Um, like I say, I think it was racing. This is uh, this is all correct. These glass look all dead white, period, and all the rest of it. Grill's in good condition. I hardly picked up a fly. Look, perfect. No one's pushed on it like an idiot. Um, it's absolutely lovely. I think it's really nice. Just right for a bit of recommissioning and a, a bit of um, a bit of weekend work almost. Not really a great deal want doing to it. But my advice, seriously, don't spend loads and loads of time and money at it. Enjoy the damn thing as it is. There you go.